Taiwan share of global contract semiconductor chips is 63% of the global market. And now, because other economies in the world are recovering, there are even more demand than before. Because of lockdowns, some households, they have upgraded their fridges, their washing machines, and therefore chips was actually almost used up. And now, actually even more demand because many governments, their fiscal stimulus includes 5G network infrastructure, which needs a lot of semiconductor chips. But supply is now at risk because Taiwan has three negative factors. Water shortage. In the process of producing these chips, they need a lot of clean water. Weather. It is unusually hot. It uses up a lot of electricity by household turning on the air conditioners. So there are at least two blackouts in this week. Any blackouts will mean that chip production need to stop. The third factor is COVID. And now it could lead to a lockdown. Shipping ports will not have enough workers. So they cannot ship to other parts of the world. What we are using, either the prices have to go up or we have to live backward with fewer functions in electronic goods. So it will lead to, it could lead to an inflation, a global inflation if everyone wants these chips.